This video will be on privilege escalation. Attackers start by finding weak points to gain access to a system. In most cases, that first point of penetration isn't going to give the attackers with level of access they need. This network intrusion assault called privilege escalation take use of programming faults or design defects to give the attacker enhanced access to the network and its data and applications. There are two types of privilege escalation vertical and horizontal. Let's keep this simple. Horizontal privilege escalation involves gaining access to accounts with privileges that are similar to the one attacker has. And vertical privilege escalation involves gaining access to accounts with more privileges and permissions. While horizontal privilege escalation seems pointless, it is not. The attacker is basically gaining the ground. Like getting access to certain application that certain sales rep might have that the marketing analyst might not. Attackers are very careful when they move laterally, and they dig up all the information they can get their hands on to help them come up with a plan to escalate vertically if needed. There might not be need for a vertical escalation. Attackers may just need certain people's account to dig up their email traffic. Why escalate vertically and risk getting caught due to time constraint or higher security for higher profile accounts when you could go laterally and get the information that you need? Every point is an opening for attackers to delve deeper into the system. So both horizontal and vertical attacks must be addressed with speed.